channel. Um, yeah, it's kind of awkward filming your first video. You don't really know what to say. You feel kind of awkward. Yeah. Um, anyway, this is my very first video, so please forgive me if it's kind of crappy. Um, I decided to film a new YouTubers tag that I found through a couple of other YouTubers. I can't remember their names now, I'm sorry. But I basically just copied and pasted it because it was the same one that I saw over and over again, so I figured that was the official tag. Um, I guess I've decided it was a good way to start off because it lets you know a little bit about me. Um, if you have any requests, if you're watching, let me know in the comment section. Tell me what you want to know about me more. If you want to see tutorials or room tours or hauls or <laughs> favorites or whatever. <laughs> anyway, uh, here is my so here are the YouTube questions. tag. Number one, your first name. My first name is Elizabeth. Number two, reasons for starting YouTube. I would say that I've been watching it for a long time. I would say probably close on five years now. I've been watching other girls do this. And I kind of fell in love with it. I just found it really entertaining and helpful. Pretty much everything I know about makeup has come from other YouTubers. And I decided I wanted to get out on the action too. It seemed like a really fun hobby and a good way to get yourself out there and, you know, build up a bit of confidence. So I would guess that would be my main reason. Number three, when did you get passionate about makeup? I'd say late high school. So around grade 11, grade 12, that's when I started to wear the most makeup. And that's probably the period of time so far in my life that I wore the most makeup. When I got to university, I kind of toned it down a bit. I don't wear nearly as much as I used to, or at least I make it look a little more natural now. Maybe it's from practice. But yeah, I'd probably say grade 11, grade 12 is when I really got passionate about it. But I've always loved makeup and different cosmetics and stuff. I've always been called goo girl in my family because my bathroom cupboards have always been filled with bottles and bottles and bottles and bottles of stuff. Number four, what other interests do you have besides makeup? Um, my biggest hobby would probably be photography. I started when I was about 16 years old when I got my first SLR camera, which I still use. Um, and yeah, it's just kind of grown. I haven't taken any like courses or anything, but that's always been my main hobby. That's what people tend to know is my biggest interest. Um, and I also really like like cooking and baking and traveling has always been really fun and eye-opening to me too. So I would say those things are my other main interests. Something odd about you. I that I dilute juice. But I find that a lot of juice is just really concentrated and it makes me even more thirsty. So I end up pouring like three quarters of the glass full of juice and then the rest of it is water. So that's probably the biggest odd thing about me that I can think of. My favorite TV show. Like most people, I'm probably saying, well, I don't really have one. But I watch a lot of TLC, so if that counts, my TV channel that I watch most is TLC. So things like 19 Kids and Counting, Say Yes to the Dress, Four Weddings, uh, Cake Boss. Long Island Medium, all those things are probably what I've watched the most right now. I also really like the home, like, reno shows, like Property Brothers, Fixer Upper, um, those kind of shows I really like, too. My favorite color. In terms of actually visually looking at a color, I'd probably pick pink. But in terms of actually wearing colors, I don't like to wear a lot of pink clothing. So I would have to say blue. I wear a lot of like navy blue and gray and like stuff like that just because I find it looks really flattering on me. So I'd say overall my favorite color is pink, but I like rain blue more. What do I do most days? If you're talking about like during the semester, I get up in the morning, I get ready, I go to class, I come home, and I sit on the couch and eat food. I watch YouTube, of course. Are you a spender or a saver? This one, it kind of depends. If I have a lot of money in my account and I'm not saving up to go anywhere or for anything in particular, I tend to spend. 
But if I have, I know I have a trip coming up, and I know I'm gonna be able to go shopping and have good access to good shopping, then I save like nobody's business. <laughs> if you were a Disney princess, who would you be? Probably Belle. I've always loved Belle very much, and I find her dress absolutely gorgeous. Favorite beauty product? Right now, I would say my favorite beauty product would be the Urban Decay Deslicked De Slick Makeup Setting Spray. comes in a bottle like this, but basically this is a makeup setting spray, so you spray this on your face after you're done with your makeup, and it sets it for the day, and because it's a De Slick formula, it will control oil throughout the day, and I find that's exactly what it does. So that's currently my favorite product. I find that it mists really well, like in terms of just being evenly dispersed and not making one area too wet. I don't know if you can see that. But yeah. <laughs> it has a nice scent to it too. So definitely worth the $32. Favorite perfume. My favorite perfume is the DKNY Be Delicious Fresh Blossom, which looks like this. Oh, you can see my laptop. Um, but basically it's the pink one and I looked up the notes on Sephora DKNY Be Delicious Fresh Blossom is a radiant new fragrance that marries freshness, vibrancy, and femininity a blend of sparkling grapefruit, cassis, and sun-kissed apricot meets a blooming floral heart of sheer muguit and petally rose wrapped in a luminous jasmine a base of juicy apple mingled with lingering blonde woods and a smooth skin accord, whatever that is, completes the irresistibly sensual experience of the essence. As it's very fresh, it's kind of a bit of fruity and floral mixed in, and I find it's great day fragrance, but you can wear it at night too. I usually do both. Favorite song? I'm really liking Bartender by Lady Antebellum. I just find that's been kind of my anthem lately. I just rock out to that song for some reason. Number 14 is what is your favorite lipstick? And the one I picked out is probably my newest lipstick. I don't have that many, but this is probably the newest one. Okay, this is from Maybelline. It's from their new Vivids collection. So it comes in a big, bright, I know it kind of looks pink on my webcam, I'm sorry. But it's a bright orange neon plastic square container like this. And it kind of looks more like bubblegum hot pink on camera right now. But it's actually more of like a more of like a raspberry pink or a watermelon pink in real life. Um, number is 875 and it's called Vivid Rose. When I want to do like a going out lip and I want to look super dolled up and fancy, this is what I reach for. Smells like vanilla cake and it wears really well. It's very moisturizing. So that's my new YouTubers tag. I hope you enjoyed it. I'm sorry the quality isn't that great on my video. I'm just using my laptop. But I hope you enjoyed it and I will be back soon.